What's going on YouTube? This is The End Zone. We have a nice draft preview for you today in the XFL draft. And uh, to start off this video, I'm going to flash all the names on the screen of all the players who are in the draft. Uh, each slide is going to be about like three seconds long, so you're going to have to pause to read all the names. There are tons of players in this draft. Um, I've gone over a lot of them, but I'm going to flash every single name that is in the draft pool. So um, if you want to look, look at these names, you can. You're probably just going to have to pause. And if you don't, you can skip through. Um, you don't have to look at all the names. But there are some interesting players entering the draft. So now we're going to start that. So yeah guys, that is the player list. Now if you came to my channel looking for more details on the draft itself, you came to the right place. The draft is on October 15th and 16th. There are five phases, not rounds. Um, on October 15th, there will be 10 rounds each, starting off with the skill player phase, then the O-line, then the D-line, and on the 16th, there will be 10 rounds for the defensive backfield, and 30 rounds to finish off the draft. Just an open draft, free for all. And uh, the draft will also be a snake draft. I'm not sure about trades, if any teams are trading, but it is probably a possibility that some teams will trade, um, maybe to get players or more picks. Who really knows? If you're wondering on how to watch the draft, it's actually kind of a tricky situation. They say that each player selection will be announced on social media. So that brings in the question, can I live stream the draft? I can, probably just you know, one round, I, I guess. I don't really know how it's gonna go. Um, I'll do my best. I am in college, I am a freshman. School is very difficult, but I will try my best to live stream the draft and give you my opinion on the players drafted. Here's some additional information on how players will be paid. Uh, basically, it says $55,000 is going to be the average salary. Here's some more in-depth information on that. The pay doesn't seem that bad at all. In fact, you can make more money if uh, you're playing better and your team is winning. I really like that aspect of the XFL uh, pay structure. Look at the quarterbacks here. Um, now, take this with a grain of salt, but they can make a lot of money, uh, especially these top-tier quarterbacks. Comment down below what players you are excited to see in the XFL and what quarterbacks you want to see in the XFL. We still don't really know the top tier eight quarterbacks, which they've been talking about. I assumed we'd get them before the draft. Uh, apparently not. Also, jerseys. Where are the jerseys? I wanted those before the draft. Maybe we get a surprise. Highly doubt that at this point. But there's always a chance. Thanks for watching The End Zone. Make sure to like and subscribe.